How's it going everyone? Welcome back and today we're going to talk about this. A problem repeatedly occurs on a specific website right on your Safari browser. So this is a very common problem that happens with your iPhone, especially in Safari browser. Then here is how I can simply solve that problem. So without wasting any more time, let's go. The very first work that you really, really want to take a look at is the cache and cookies that your browser might save on your device. So first head over to your settings on iPhone. Then you got to scroll down here, select apps, find out your Safari browser. And once you just come over here, now you have to just find out this option called an um, extension. First, if you are using any extension whatsoever with your Safari browser, the first work that you want to do, you make sure to just stop them for a few moments just to see if that works or not. Right after that, you want to just come to the Safari browser settings one more time, scroll down to the bottom, select advance and select website data now you can see there are few website data already been stored in my browser so if you have the same thing simply select to remove all website data tap remove now then get back here scroll it up and now tap clear history and the data select all history and select uh, make sure to enable close all tab clear all the history here get out of here now simply restart your iphone now this is a very simple thing guys right after restarting your iphone your problem should be solved by now but still if you see well you might have the same problems that are popping up on your browser the next you gotta head over to your settings scroll down here open up your screen time you gotta open up to your content app privacy restriction make sure to disable that feature sometime if you're allowing uh, you know the web store or if you are putting some restrictions to a certain website it might give you this you know same types of error so make sure you're uh, i mean from this content you are selecting unrestricted and you're turning off the content and privacy restrictions from your uh, screen time on iphone after that go and take a look at your problems one more time and see what happens after that, your problem is going to be solved. However, if you still have problems, you gotta double check the URL that you're trying to go through from your browser. Sometimes if the error URL is invalid, you might face the same problems on your iPhone. Just go ahead and take a look at it and see if that works or not. If nothing is useful, then I would highly recommend you guys just try downloading the Google Chrome um, directly from your you know, app store and then try to visit the website from your chrome browser and this time it will definitely work for yourself if you still have questions please do let me know in the comment section guys see you all around